join me with Fox's Product Development Director, Sean McSpadden, who's going to talk us through the new range of black label bot indicators that are due to hit the shelves very, very soon. Sean, talk us through it. Well, basically, Lewis, you, there's two main formats. There's the kit board and there's the accessory board. I'll start with the kit board because it's probably the most simple place to start. Um, there's two main bobbins. There's your standard bobbin and there's your slick bobbin. Your standard bobbin, very, very simple bobbin, which is customizable from the accessory board or on the accessory board you can make up your own bespoke bobbin. But we'll start with the basic bobbin, you've got a nine inch Dacron cord, a hockey stick, slim bobbin head and an adjustable conventional ball clip. On the slick bobbins, very very simple again, you've got a three inch ball chain, the slim bobbin head again, but more importantly on the top of here, which I'll come on to more detail later, you've got the adjustable tension slick bobbin head. It's a little bit special that. It is, it covers slack line fishing, distance fishing, or if you want to alternatively unscrew that, put it onto a small bobbin head and use a spring around for distance fishing, you can do, but we'll come onto that in more detail later. Colours available, we've got white, blue, red, purple, green, and a nice gun smoke. Yeah, the, the two main colours this year, Lewis, like you say, is the purple and the gun smoke. We've been making white, blue, green, red hangers for many years and they're still very popular to this day. Um, you, you don't see an amber at the moment, um, not so popular, so we decided to replace them colours with a purple and a gun smoke. Okay, so we've got the set bobbins. As you said, you can customise them. Let's have a look at how you can customise these bobbins. No problem. Like you say, the kit board, Lewis, um, all these components on here are compatible with the kits. So if you want to make a larger head, you can do by slim, simply buying the fat head which slides over the slim hanger or you want to use the micro head or you want to alternate your colours, mix and match the colours, the choice is yours really and then obviously if you chains wise you've got a three inch link chain, a nine inch link chain, a three inch ball chain, a nine inch ball chain, a nine inch Dacron cord, a half ounce glass fibre quiver arm which are fantastic for distance fishing, tight line zig fishing, that kind of approach and the mini swinger arm, which are ideal for winter conditions or windy conditions. Wicked. So you can buy the bobbins as they are and then customise them afterwards, chop and change. Mm -hmm. Or if you want to start off from scratch with a, with a springer or a mini swinger, you can take it by the hockey stick, a body, one of the arms mm -hmm. and the, the clip of your choice as well and build a bobbin from scratch if you, if you want to go straight in to one of these more specialist springer or swinger arms. Exactly, you know, it's impossible for us to manufacture a bobbin that's going to satisfy everybody. You know, so we've covered most of the bases with the simple kits, which like you say, can be customized. Or for the guy that just wants a, you know, a springer or a certain color or a certain size head, he's got the full choice on the board. And as you say, no one indicator can please all the anglers and no one indicator can cover all fishing situations. No. So let's have a look at the different fishing situations and the different indicators that you would customise to get the best bite indication and hopefully help you catch more fish. Sure, okay, let's, let's have a look. Okay, Sean, so let's have a look at some of these different customisable options that you can do. Starting off with, this is the standard slick bobbin as it can be bought off the shelf in kit format. Correct. I notice you've got the line fairly slack there. Is that an indication of to what this indicator yeah, is best suited for? Yeah, generally I'd, I'd, I'd use this bobbin for short to medium range work, you know, slack to slackish lines. Um, I say the benefit of the slate clip is the attention is adjustable. So regarding if you're using thin lines one day for distance fishing, you know, then you go to a, you know, a larger diameter fluorocarbon for close in work, slack line fishing, you can just simply adjust the tension, make the clip slightly tighter to grip your line properly. So at the minute this slick clip is actually gripping the line so the line cannot actually pass through that head at the moment so that's making it ultra sensitive from this end I'm, I'm right in thinking. Exactly yeah. Now but with a with other types of bobbin that are currently available that grip the line I believe the problem is as soon as you get a take the clip can pull off the line and leave your bobbin mm -hmm. no longer attached to your line so if the fish then decides to come towards you and give you a drop back you've no longer got any indication but I believe this system that's, has been designed to be slightly different. Exactly. In, inside that um, slick head, you've basically got your, your, your two plates where your line is gripped. Once your line goes tight, it'll go into a recess there. It'll come out of the clip 
into a hole if you like, so your line can pass it's through. It's now free running. It's now free running. So if it comes away, it doesn't damage your line at all because it's gone into that recess. Yep. Um, basically, like it's acting like a, a conventional ball clip now. And, you know, as you say, if the fish come towards you, it's still attached. Your bobbin's still on. Fantastic. And as soon as you lift the rod up, it'll come out like a conventional ball clip. Yep. Uh, obviously, it'll just very easily just off exactly. when you strike the rod. No problem Fantastic. At all. Okay then. So now imagine using this, but the wind gets up. The, you see there the bobbin swinging around. Real strong wind. Mm -hmm. You start to get false bleeps. It's hard to start identifying between whether it's carp giving you liners or whether it's the wind giving you false indications. Mm -hmm. So, using the customised accessories within the range, you, you can you can very cheaply change that indicator and exactly. eliminate that. Exactly, Lewis. What I do then is got to go to the short, stiff swinger arm, yep. um, and it's dead dead easy to change. You just simply unscrew your bobbin from the hockey stick. Again, you can unscrew this head or you can change to one of the smaller heads or you've got your fat head over this head. Yep. You know, it's all interchangeable. You simply screw that onto the end of your swinger arm. Onto the hockey stick. Back onto your hockey stick. Make sure everything's in line. Back on. And there you go. Now you're using a swinger arm, eliminating that cross crosswind. Exactly. So Fantastic. Not, you know, you've not got the movement from side to side. It's not swinging around in the wind. You're not getting false indication. Generally, I'll clip that up as well. And also, they look very, very tarty. They do indeed. Moving on again. The fishing situation you're in changes. You're going to start fishing at long range, up against snags, swapping over to zig rigs where you're going to be using tight lines. You've got you can customise the bobbin again for an indicator that's even more sensitive for that style of fishing exactly. with the springer arm. Exactly. I mean, what I've found very, very useful for, the, for this system is, like you've just said, if you zig fishing on a very, very tight line, um, in excess of you know, 100, 150 yards or whatever you, you may be fishing at, these are absolutely fantastic for, uh, for by indication. And again, simply unscrew your, your swinger arm on this occasion take your head off if that's your head of choice just get your head back on and back onto the hockey stick back so onto quick the hockey stick so quick so easy yet allowing you to change yeah. and maximize your bite indication to the situation you're fishing with Extremely sensitive again. Fantastic. Well, you've sold me on it, Sean, for for sure. I, the, the the opportunities really are endless, and you know, not only do they have a very very sound functional reason for the design, they also look very tarty. Complement all of the black label bank wear to a T. I reckon they're onto a winner with this. <laughs>